when I come back, we will be False building a honeydew statue. So hold on to your butts, because it's about to get nostalgic in here. All right. I leave you great, with Simon. Great clean jokes for funny people who don't swear. Here we go. This this is about right. Why did the tomato blush? Because it saw the salad dressing. What do you call bears with no ears, B? I don't get it. What do dentists call x-rays? Toothpicks. Toothpicks. Ah, right, yeah. Did you hear about the first restaurant to open on the moon? It had great food, but no atmosphere. Spit off my monitor. I only noticed because it's like a white website, which I don't even know what people are doing with websites with white backgrounds in the year 2021. Come on, son, get it. Get a fucking grip. What did one wall say to the other wall? I meet you at the corner. When does a joke become a dad joke when the punchline is apparent? apparent? <clears throat> what did the paper say to the pencil right on? How did the bullet lose his job? He, job he, got, f he got fired. Got f he got caught stealing from the till. Uh, why should you never trust stairs? They're always up, up to something. Up, They're always up to something. Up to yeah. Sometimes I tuck my knees into my chest and I lean forward. That's just how I roll. What do you call a cheese that's not yours? Nacho cheese. Not nat not your not your cheese. Not your cheese. Not your cheese. Not your cheese. What did you hear about the cheese fact? Why is there another cheese story? What's what's it? well not story joke. I mean it is kind of a story. Story about a cheese factory that exploded in uh, France. It was very sad. Twelve people died. Um, there was nothing left but the de debris, de debris, de debris, debris. Why did the kid throw his clock out the window? Because he wanted to see time fly. Which bird has the worst manners? Mocking birds. What do you get from a pampered cow? Spoiled milk. I can't... Oh, I get it, because it's wearing pampers, which are like nappies, and the milk gets all shit in it. Okay, that's quite funny. That's a clever joke. I can't take my dog to the park because the ducks keep trying to bite him. I guess that's what I get for buying a purebred dog. I, what? you gotta, you got to think about that one, chat. you got to think about that one. Uh, what did the big flower say to the little flower? Hi, bud. What does NASA... How, how, how does... How does NASA organize a party? They, they plan it. They plan... How many tickles does it take to get an octopus to laugh? Ten tickles. There are 64 of these, and we're up to... This is ten, uh, 20. We're up to now. Out of 64. Pure bread dog. Because du ducks won't leave him alone because it's a pure bread dog. Pure bread dog. Because it's, like the... it's like the dog, it's not mixed with other races of dog. Um, it's pure bread, um, which is a homophone for uh, bread, as in the food stuff. Um, with an A in bread. Bread. And ducks like bread. You shouldn't feed bre bread to ducks. You shouldn't feed ducks to bread. It's bad. It's bad for them. It makes them explode or something. No, that's rice. That's rice. Bread. Probably fine. If you... Uh, do you know what? I think a duck would, wouldn't turn down a cheese and pickle sandwich. Would it now? Okay, joke 20. What's the difference between a poorly dressed man on a unicycle and a well dressed man on a bicycle attire? Uh huh. Hello? I mean, it's a wheel. It's a wheel, really, not a tire. But, um, gee, hello. Hello, my dear. I, I, you've been telling wholesome jokes. I heard. I called... wholesome jokes. <clears throat> Good jokes for the family <coughs> to enjoy. 